Have you ever felt overwhelmed by how fast AI is moving? One day, it's ChatGPT helping you write emails. The next, AI tools are building apps, generating videos, and even running entire workflows by themselves. It feels like we're living in a sci-fi movie. But here's the big question. With so much happening, how do we even begin to learn AI in 2025? What's worth your time? And how do we turn all of this into opportunities for yourself? Here's where I can help. I've spent the last year working full-time with AI. It hasn't just transformed my work. I'm now more than 10 times more productive than I used to be. And I've built systems that are helping me make $25,000 a month profit by using these tools. This is the kind of leverage that changes everything. And if I had to start all over again, I'd know exactly where I'd focus in order to learn AI in 2025. And in this video, I'm gonna show you the path to mastering these tools and using them to build your future. Imagine this, you're using AI to design a product. Your avatar explains it in a viral video while AI agents handle the workflows behind the scenes. You've built a system where AI does the heavy lifting and you focus on the big picture creative ideas. This isn't just possible, it's happening right now. Whether you're starting a career, launching a business, or just trying to stay ahead, this video will give you the roadmap to leverage AI and turn it into your biggest advantage. All right, let's get into it. If I could start learning AI again in 2025, there's one thing I'd focus on above everything else, becoming an AI generalist. So what does that mean? Coined by my good friend, Liam Otley, the term AI generalist describes someone who knows how to use multiple AI tools together, not just a specialist in one area, but someone who can adapt, create, and solve problems by combining skills and tools across the AI landscape. Think of an AI generalist like a Swiss army knife of the AI world. Instead of being really good at one thing, you're the person that knows how to combine tools to tackle any task. For example, you're not just someone who knows how to code. You use AI to write and debug code faster. You're not just somebody that creates content. You use AI to generate content at a 10x output. You're not just somebody that automates workflows. You design systems that handle tasks while you sleep. In a world where AI is everywhere, generalists are going to be the ones that will thrive. So here's why being an AI generalist is going to be so important. One, adaptability. Technology is evolving rapidly, but generalists can adapt by learning new tools and systems and staying nimble on their feet. This allows them to take advantage of any new opportunities and tools that actually come up in the AI landscape. Two, creativity. Generalists aren't just limited to one skill. They can think across disciplines and find unique solutions. Number three, Leverage. AI generalists know how to multiply their impact by combining tools like large language models, workflows, and content creation. Four, opportunity. Whether you want to freelance, start a business, or work in tech, being an AI generalist makes you incredibly valuable because you can do so many things. Being an AI generalist isn't about knowing everything. It's about knowing enough to be able to connect the dots between different tools. So here's what being an AI generalist looks like. You use LLMs to generate ideas, and answer questions or even solve problems. You know how to automate workflows using AI agents. You can build and improve software with AI using different coding platforms, even without knowing how to code. And you can market your own ideas through AI generated content. It's about seeing the bigger picture and knowing how to make these AI tools work together. But here's the key. Becoming an AI generalist doesn't mean mastering everything overnight. It's about learning enough to be able to combine tools in creative and impactful ways. By focusing on this skill, you're really going to set yourself apart in 2025 and beyond. Now that you know about the importance of becoming an AI generalist, let's talk about how to get there. In the next section, we'll talk about the first building block, understanding and using large language models. If I could start over learning AI in 2025, here's exactly where I'd begin. You have to understand the basics of large language models, otherwise known as LLMs, because they're the building blocks of so much that is happening in the AI space right now. Now. Large language models like ChatGPT and Claude are AI systems that are trained on the entire internet. Think of things like websites, blogs, text, chat conversations, all these different things that these AI models are trained on. Their job is to predict the next word in a sentence, one word at a time. That's how they could write essays, solve problems, or even write code. It's like having a super smart assistant that's incredible at predicting patterns, even though it doesn't truly understand language like we do. Think of LLMs as the foundation of a house. Before you can build advanced AI systems or even use AI agents, you need to understand how tools like ChatGPT and Claude work because you'll see these models everywhere. 
automating workflows, powering apps, and even creating tools that think and act like AI employees. Here's something really important to know. There isn't just one LLM. Tools like ChatGPT, Claude, Gemini, and others might all feel the same on the surface, but they each have their own strengths. Some are better at creative tasks, others at summarizing, or handling complex workflows. Think of it like having different tools in a toolbox. Understanding that some large language models are better suited for certain tasks will help you make smart choices as you go deeper into the world of AI. Here's where things get interesting. LLMs are amazing but they're not passive. They need you to guide them, to prompt them with instructions and tell them what to do. But what if you didn't have to do all that work yourself? What if you could combine large language models with tools that can plan tasks, make decisions and act on their own? That's where AI agents come in. They take LLMs to the next level, allowing you to automate workflows and solve complex problems without micromanaging every step. So to wrap up large language models, here's all you need to know for now. Large language models predict text. They're incredible at following your instructions and different LLMs have different specialties. So if you're starting from scratch, I'd focus on learning how large language models work and just learn the basics. I'd really focus on practicing how to prompt them effectively because this is a massive skill to learn. And then also understanding where they fit in in the bigger picture when it comes to AI systems. And lastly, I'd learn which LLMs to use for different use cases. Once you understand those basic concepts, it's time to move on to the next step. And that is learning about AI agents. And trust me, this is where things get really exciting. So now you've got a grasp on LLMs, these incredible AI tools that can assist you with things like writing, coding, and problem solving. But here's the thing, as powerful as LLMs are, they're still reactive. That means that they wait for you to tell them what to do. But what if AI did not need constant instructions? What if it could take a goal, figure out the steps, and handle the tasks on its own? That's exactly what AI agents do. AI agents are systems that are designed to act independently. At a basic level, they combine tools like LLMs with other AI tools. This lets them plan, make decisions, and execute tasks without your giving guidance. Instead of just responding, they could handle multiple step processes on their own. Try to think of an AI agent like a project manager. They take your goal, break it into smaller steps, and check tasks off that list. That's what AI agents do. They plan, adapt and get the job done. At the end of the day, that's all that matters. They're able to complete the job. So here's how this ties back to what we've already learned in this video. At their core, most AI agents use LLMs as their brains. These models process information, generate ideas and make decisions. But an AI agent doesn't stop there. It layers on extra tools and logic to actually take action. Think of it like this. LLMs are the heart of the system, but AI agents are the body. They enable movement and interaction with the real world. So with that being said, here are some AI agent tools and platforms to actually get familiar with. Langchain is a great framework for combining LLMs with tools like APIs and databases. AutoGPT lets GPT act as an autonomous agent to execute tasks. Even tools like Zapier are making it extremely easy to build AI agents with no code with their new feature called Zapier Central. These tools that I mentioned help you move beyond simple prompts. They allow you to create systems that can think and act independently. As AI evolves, knowing about how AI agents work and leveraging them will be a massive advantage. Think of AI agents as AI employees. These agents are eventually going to be replacing a bunch of jobs over the coming years in every single industry that we know it. And if you have the ability to build AI agents for yourself to make yourself more productive or build AI agents and employees for other people in specific use cases, you're gonna become extremely valuable to the AI landscape. If you're serious about about building a business around AI or making yourself useful, start researching platforms like Zapier Central and AutoGPT. This will give you a massive head start in understanding the future of AI agents. You really don't see how powerful they are until you start building things yourself. Now let's focus on tools that are reshaping the way we create AI coding platforms. These platforms aren't just tools. They're unlocking massive opportunities. Basically, they're making it possible for anyone to create, innovate, and scale faster than ever before. Even SaaS development, which was once reserved for large teams, is now accessible to everyone. So what exactly are AI coding platforms? AI coding platforms combine AI powered tools with traditional programming workflows. They act like your personal assistant, helping you write, 
debug and optimize code. But here's the game changer. You can now build powerful software solutions, even SaaS applications with minimal or no coding experience yourself. For example, I'm a non-technical person. I built some really cool software products using these different tools on this YouTube channel. This means you don't need to be a developer to actually start creating cool products that you could then begin marketing and selling. Here's why this matters. So take SaaS, software as a service. It used to require massive teams, long timelines, and big budgets. But AI coding platforms are breaking down these barriers and completely democratizing this industry. Now, individuals and small teams can build software products at the fraction of the price and in record speed. This basically makes software development accessible to anyone that can get their hands on these platforms. And this is going to completely change the way that we interact with software on our computers. No longer are the builders going to be the valuable ones on the market. Here are some of the platforms I'm using to build cool products. All you need to do is type in what you want to build and it will begin coding them for you. Platforms I like are lovable.dev, bolt.new, GitHub Copilot, and Cursor AI. And here's why learning these platforms is gonna be so valuable. And I really want you to pay attention here. We're entering a world where ideas are more valuable than technical expertise. If you can imagine a solution, you can build it or use AI to help you build it. But building is just one piece of the puzzle. The other part, marketing. And here's the key. When anyone can create software, the ability to market your product becomes everything. That's why building a personal brand like this is one of the most powerful ways to promote your product. Your audience doesn't just want a product. They want to trust the person behind it. AI coding platforms will help you make amazing tools, but content will help you share your story, grow your audience, and market those tools effectively. We're at a point in time where everybody knows building a personal brand is extremely valuable. Hell, I completely underestimated it when I started making videos two years ago, and it's completely changed my life. And the good part, AI is making content generation easier than ever. From text to video, AI is enabling creators to scale their personal brands and connect with their audiences like never before. In the next section, I'll explain why AI-generated content is a massive skill you need to learn going into 2025. I talked about creating with AI, coding platforms, workflows, etc. But none of this matters if nobody knows what we're building. And that's where content comes in. AI is making content creation faster, smarter, and more scalable than ever before. And one of the most fascinating parts of this revolution, AI avatars. And stick with me because I know this may sound crazy. AI avatars are a digital representation of people powered by AI. They can look and act like real humans or represent entirely new characters. You can use AI avatars to deliver presentations or tutorials, explain products or ideas, or even act as the face of your brand without needing to appear on camera like this. At first, AI avatars might seem a little odd, weird, maybe even silly. But here's the truth. They're gonna completely change the way we interact with content. Now, let's talk about why these are actually going to matter. Number one, consistency. Your avatar delivers your message perfectly every time. No reshoots or no missed deadlines. Number two, scalability. Avatars allow brands to help scale their content creation without hiring new teams or paying expensive influencers. Number three, global reach. AI avatars can speak multiple languages, helping brands connect with audiences all over the world. Imagine this, a brand launches a global product and uses an AI avatar, and they're able to create multilingual content with dozens of markets instantly. Here's where it gets even more interesting. Brands are already using AI avatars instead of paying influencers. Why? Because avatars are fully customizable. They can look, sound, and behave exactly how brands want without the unpredictability of working with actual humans. And it may seem crazy, but this isn't theoretical because this is actually happening right now. Take a look at Rowan Chung on Instagram. He's built a massive following simply by using an AI avatar for his viral videos. Brands are going to follow this model as it gets more and more common. Using avatars to create viral content, market products, and build trust with their audience. If you're interested in playing around with this, make sure to try out Synthesia and HeyGen. These are two amazing AI avatar platforms and they'll blow your mind when you play around with them. So avatars are already transforming how we interact with content, but they're just one piece of the content puzzle. The next big leap, AI generated videos. Imagine creating entire videos 
from script to visuals to editing, powered entirely with AI. It's not just faster, it's making professional quality video production accessible to everyone. In the next section, we'll explain how AI is changing the way videos are made and how tools like Sora are opening up massive opportunities for creators and brands alike. AI generated video is one of the most exciting advancements in content creation. It's taking everything we've talked about from LLMs to avatars and combining them to create professional quality videos, all powered by AI. Here's why this matters. Traditionally, video production has been time consuming. You'll need a script writer, camera crew, editors, and a ton of time to bring this all together. But AI changes all of that. Now you can create high quality content in minutes, from concept to visuals to editing, all with the help of AI tools. And the best part, you don't need a big budget or any technical expertise. AI generated video is for sure leveling the playing field. It's making video creation accessible to small businesses, freelancers, and even solo creators. So what can you do with AI-generated video? You can create engaging marketing campaigns, produce tutorials and explainer videos, or generate eye-catching social media content. The possibilities are endless. Here are a couple of the tools that are kind of leading the charge of this AI-generated video market. First of all, there is Sora. Sora is OpenAI's text-to-video platform, and it's absolutely mind-blowing. Runway is another great platform to create professional looking video in seconds with AI. Imagine this, you need a product demo video. You feed your script into a platform like Sora and in minutes it creates a polished video complete with visuals, background music, and transitions. That's the power of AI generated videos and it's only gonna get better. Not only does AI generated videos save you time, but it opens up new creative possibilities. You can experiment with styles, test new formats, and create content that used to take entire teams. Now you can do it all by yourself. This isn't the future, it's happening right now. And as these tools continue to improve, the gap between creators and high budget production is shrinking fast and there's lots of opportunity. All right, AI video tools are reshaping content creation. They save time, reduce costs, and make professional video accessible to everyone. Whether you're building a personal brand, marketing a product, or creating content for fun, learning how to use AI video tools is gonna be a massive skill to have going into 2025. So there you have it. If I had to start relearning AI in 2025, here's exactly where I'd begin. Let's recap what we've gone over. We talked about why becoming an AI generalist is the ultimate skill and it's something you need to do. We talked about how to build a foundation by learning what large language models are. We also discussed how AI agents, workflows, and coding platforms are transforming the way we create and work. And how AI generated content, including avatars, images, and videos is reshaping the way that we interact with the world. Here's the takeaway. AI is no longer just a tool. It's the ultimate leverage. And focus on that word leverage. If you could focus on mastering these areas, you'll be ahead of the curve, whether you're starting a business, building your personal brand, or just exploring the possibilities. That's what I started doing a year and a half ago, just explored the possibilities and it's completely changed my life and it could change your life too. And I'm not just saying that. All right, thank you so much for watching. If you found this video enjoyable and helpful, make sure to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe to this YouTube channel. We cover all things AI for non-techies, so if you want to become an AI generalist and you want to learn everything you need to know about AI to stay ahead of the curve and build a life for yourself, this is the channel for that. So make sure to subscribe, send this to a friend, and I'll see you guys in the next video.